guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, I'm Serene, and today is my monthly favorites for November 2018. I love sharing with you every month what I've been enjoying in terms of beauty, fashion, and lifestyle. I found some really cool products that I don't think a lot of you guys either know about or have heard of. I always love discovering new things and sharing that with you guys. So if you're new, welcome back. And if you're returning, welcome back. If you enjoy what you see, make sure you're subscribed to my channel and turn on that bell notification so that you know whenever I upload a new video, which will be pretty much a ton in December because I am doing Vlogmas. And for me, what Vlogmas is, is sit down, produced content, as well as including some vlogging in there. So you'll get a mix of both and kind of get to know me a little bit more. I do have a video coming up to open up Vlogmas talking about my history here on YouTube, where I've grown. 2018 for me really was a growing year, a very painful growing year. Before that, let's talk about my monthly favorites for November. 2018, second to last favorites of 2018. Where has time gone? It's insane. Dolly, Cooper. Don't forget, I always include timestamps and all the products will be listed in the description box. The Cora Organics Turmeric Brightening and Exfoliating Mask. It says it's a two-in-one. For me, I definitely believe it's a two-in-one. It's a brightening and exfoliating mask for sure. What I love about this is it's clean, it's natural, and it's really effective. I like to use this once a week, and what I'll do is I'll wash my face, and before drying it with a towel, I'll go in with this mask because you want to apply it on damp skin. You'll apply it, and when you're applying it, there's these small little granules that help physically exfoliate, but, and then you let it sit for anywhere between 10 minutes. You definitely feel it working at around five to 10 minutes. Then I'll go in with a little bit of warm water, massage my face, and really get that exfoliation even further in and breaking down the mask because the mask will dry a bit and this will break down the mask make it easier to remove and then I'll splash with warm water or I'll take a warm washcloth and remove all of the mask it's got this really lovely like cooling feeling so you feel the soothing sensations of this mask it's not minty it's just really soothing and cooling so I love that because you want to soothe the skin but you also want to exfoliate so while it's exfoliating it's like soothing it and it doesn't strip my skin it's perfect to use I have pretty sensitive skin and I find that it gets rid of any of the dead skin cells it definitely brightens up my face but it doesn't do all of the um, stripping and sometimes a little bit more invasive things that products can do even when they are natural really really enjoy this one my next favorite skincare item I have just been loving is from SkinCeuticals this is a custom dose serum mixed for me. So I actually went to its Casilith Plastic Surgery, which is the only place that is currently doing this, but hopefully by next year they will have more locations. What they do is they analyze your skin, they ask you a bunch of questions, it's then like formulated in what ingredients you need. Plus I already use a retinol and other acids throughout my skincare routine. So what's great about this is that they didn't include that because they knew I was using that. It gets custom made, it's fresh. They're there are no preservatives in this so once you get it you need to use it within the first three months of getting it you should be using it every single day day and night so you should be able to go through it by the time it expires professional grade ingredients why am I doing that I'm sure this eyeshadow palette is of no surprise that it made it into my favorites it's the covergirl chocoholic eyeshadow palette this is such a beautiful neutral shade eyeshadow palette you could do so many looks you've got your beautiful neutrals and then you've got some fun shades to deepen up the look create different smoky looks everyday looks for girls now officially leaping bunny cruelty free so that's really exciting really proud of them for doing this it's a huge step for a brand this big hey it's also affordable and you can find it at the drugstore I really loved the performance of these shadows they lasted all day for me and there was no flaking or smudging they also blend really beautifully now these are a little bit more powdery compared to some of the other eyeshadows I own if you're applying this you might feel like it's going to be a little powdery and there's gonna be a lot of fallout but in reality it's not once it gets on there it works beautifully and it blends really lovely 
Love that it smells like vanilla chocolate. Love that they're now cruelty free and it's such a great value. My next favorite item is this Jin Soon nail polish, which is in the shade Risqué. So I recently found out Jin Soon is 10 free, which I'm very excited about because nail polish is one of the most toxic things that we put on ourselves as beauty lovers. And I love a beautiful dark nail polish. So when I discovered Coat, which is 11 and 12 free, I got really excited and they're their products are great. They last at least a week on me. If I get them professionally done, they usually last a week and a half. And the only reason I need to redo them is because of nail growth. So if you are looking for a cleaner option, definitely look at Coat and Jinsoon because they are 10 free, which is also really, really good. I love the brush. I'm able to get a really nice coat. You get this beautiful pigmentation and these beautiful luxurious shades from Jinsoon. Coat is also really gorgeous. Um, you guys know I've talked about them quite a bit. Speaking of coat and clean nail polishes, Behind the Beauty podcast season five is now live and running. It's completely free for you guys to listen to. So download all the episodes and catch up and listen. First episode of season five. Guest is one of the founders of Coat nail polish. Some shameless self-promotion. CA has extended my glow skincare kit through the end of 2018. They also are giving me a discount code for any purchase on PCA Skin's website. It is this code and it's good through the end of the year. And what will happen is you get a free full size nutrient toner. We created this kit with PCA Skin to really curate products that will give you the most glowy complexion. A lot of these products are very universal for treating a lot of different skin issues like dullness, enlarged pores, textural issues as well as overall in the brightness and glowiness. I've talked about my kit quite a bit so if you're interested in it I will link the video in the description box going through all of the products. I'll link last month's favorites video where I talk about my kit as well as some of my favorite favorite products that I can't live without from PCA Skin. I finished this book last month and honestly I finished it very shortly after last month's favorites because I could not put this book down. Educated, it's a memoir which I typically don't love but I I could not put this down. It was so interesting and it was so inspiring and it just proves that if you are motivated, you can do anything. I'm not going to tell you too much about it other than this is a woman who overcomes a lot, a lot of a lot of doubt, a lot of family judgment. Basically grew up not going to school with parents who were survivalists and didn't believe in going to the hospital or anything like that. And I love the way she writes this book because it's not judging how she grew up, it's stating the facts and her experiences without putting blame or judgment on her childhood. Such a beautifully written book, captivating, so interesting, and I could not put it down. So if you're looking for a new book to read, I love this. I'm currently listening to the final Throne of Glass series on my audible I'm like really patient I'm like very savoring it I also finished the third book of Reaper at the Gates Sabah Tahir is the author I can't think of the third book's name now and I'm not sure Reaper at the Gates was the title of any of those books I'm gonna put the book here I just finished that one I wasn't crazy about it I loved book one and two book three Mm, we'll see where it goes. Um, I don't know if that's the end. I don't think it's the end, but I wasn't that happy with book three. I'm just telling you guys, updating you guys. But definitely check out this book and uh, I'll update you guys on Throne of Glass if I finish it by next month. <sighs> so good. Okay, I gotta share with you guys Christmas Chronicles on Netflix. If you haven't watched it yet, watch it. I watched it literally twice already since it came out. First of all, it's like a family-friendly version of a Christmas version of Big Trouble in Little China, which is my favorite movie growing up. I know, I'm a weird child, I'm a weird person. I loved Big Trouble in Little China with Kurt Russell, and Kurt Russell plays Santa Claus in A Christmas Chronicle, and he is just so freaking amazing. I love him so much. It's such a fun family Christmas movie. It's really well done, it's family friendly, and it's just 
fun. I don't know how to describe it other than it's fun and I'm gonna be watching it a lot because I can just turn it on and kind of like decompress. It makes me happy, it makes me laugh and it's just so fun and it's like the kind of Christmas movie, movie that I love. And if you haven't seen it yet, watch it. It's just a great, great, cute little story. Oh, I almost forgot one more thing. This is our Do More shirts. Chris and I made these shirts because we wanted to raise money for Feed America. I discussed how in the past I felt like I couldn't do enough, so I didn't do enough in terms of donating to charity or helping charities. I never felt like I could make enough of a difference, and that's not true. So Chris and I made a whole video talking about our slogan, Do More, why we wanted to create these shirts this holiday season, and how we're going to be donating the money from the shirts to Feed America. So we extended the shirts anybody who ordered will be getting their shirts pretty soon because they are in production now we made enough sales to put them in production these are available for two more weeks so if you haven't had a chance to purchase a shirt please check them out I'll have that video linked in the cards as well as in the description box to um, learn more about what we're trying to do and how the shirts fit and kind of our our motto for do more and all that stuff yeah please help us be able to donate a significant amount if possible to feed America um, if you can't totally understandable and I will have a blog post up about how you can give back to your community and give back to those around you without having to spend any money or very very little money because I don't think doing more or giving back has to be buying things or spending money but if you can definitely do that but there are other ways we can spread love and just positivity within our community and that blog post should be up very very soon um if you guys don't know i do have a blog where it's kind of like my online journal and speaking of blogs if you want to be considered for any of my holiday giveaways make sure you sign up for my newsletter over on my blog serenelu.com. That is how all of my holiday giveaways will be run this holiday season. I'll talk a little bit more about it in my vlogmas videos, but for sure you must be signed up for my newsletter. Confirm your email after you sign up and add me to your address book so that you see my emails. And that is how I contact winners as well. If you're new, thank you so much for staying till the end. If you're returning, as always, I really appreciate your viewership. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. If you enjoyed it, uh, turn on post notifications for my channel and make sure you're subscribed. It really truly shows your support, helps my content, and keeps me able to continue to produce more and more content for you. So thank you so much for everybody who is subscribed and see you in Vlogmas. Bye!